Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kinesthetic with the Kinesthetics, and I'm here with you guys today with a new video. So this is going to be another week vlog. You guys have been loving my week vlog, so I'm going to keep it coming. Today is Monday, August 31st, the last day of August, and... I'm about to head to dinner now with Kim and my friend Michael. Um, Michael's one of my closest friends. I don't think you guys have seen him here on my channel before. So, you know, first time appearance. But um, we have a 5 o'clock reservation. And it's like 4.45 and Kim is still getting ready. As you guys can see, I'm ready. <laughs> you guys will see pictures of my outfit on Instagram. And then I have one of these earrings from ASOS. But... Yeah, before we get started, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. Hit that red subscribe button down below, period. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy. Drop a comment down below with your thoughts, comments, opinions, key keys about anything that happens in this video, whatever. And yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. So we're on our way to meet Michael. <laughs> Kim looking confused. Our reservation was for five. What time is it, Kim? Five. Twenty-seven. Don't forget that. So we're late, but Michael, we come in. What? I look cute, so we're <laughs> worth it. <laughs> Miss Mamas. I don't even know where I'm going. Yeah, that's why you need to slow down. You need to be behind me. <laughs> I guess it is this. What, girl? This could be somebody's trap house. How are your lips under the mask? <laughs> what? I said Michael and nobody responded, so. Come on. Okay. <laughs> okay. The bag. Okay guys, so I just got a package from Forever 21. Let me show you guys what I got. So the first thing I got was this hat. This was on sale for $17. I'll put it on so you guys can see. But it's real cute, it fits my head. And I have a huge head, so. Cute little vacation piece to just have in the stash. Also, I like it because it goes flat. So when you are packing, like you don't have to worry about it staying in the structured state. Um, I got these earrings, which are super cute, chunky hoops. I'll go ahead and link everything down below in case you guys want to purchase. And then I got another pair of hoops. These are pro hoops. So let me open them up so you guys can see because it has bubble wrap on it. But these are them. They're just like pro hoops. Super cute. So I'm outside. I decided to come to Home Depot to get some foil for Majesta because I have to repot her and possibly see if I could get another plant. So I'm about to go inside now and yeah. I really want a bird of paradise. So I don't see a price on this and this one's all eaten up so no. So I'm leaving now. This is what I got. I'll show you guys when I get home because I need to repot my own Paul Majesty plant. Hey guys, so today is Wednesday. Uh, uh, August September 2nd as you guys can see my face is pale a little I'm doing my glow exfoliating pads again if you guys didn't see the video where I used them then I'll link it above but I'm about to get ready to head out now I need to go to the fabric store to get some fabric for backdrops I need to go to my apple appointment at 4 35 and I need to go to Nordstrom to return the dress that I showed you guys in a previous vlog 
Real quick, let me tell you guys what happened yesterday. So I woke up at like 7 a.m. to work out, but my body just couldn't get up to, you know, work out. So I stayed in bed. Something told me to open a Nordstrom app. As soon as I opened it, like the last thing I looked at in the app was that dress. And there was one extra small available and the dress went on sale. $76. So I went ahead and bought the extra small. So that should be here, I think, tomorrow. But I'm going to go ahead and return the medium because I need my coin back. So... I'm about to go return that i need to go to sephora to exchange a lancome foundation and i also have like a lancome concealer from like a while ago that just never worked out for me so that's going back because i actually need like another fenty concealer so i'm about to run on town real quick um and when i come back i'll show you guys what i got yesterday from home depot and we'll resume chatting but for now i need to leave so that i can go out do my do come back work out make dinner and yeah i wanted to turn my camera real quick just so y'all could see the fuckery that's going on with my macbook because what is all of this like this is not my camera being dirty this is the screen honey like these little dots girl i don't know what's going on but <laughs> so and now it was just twerking i'm gonna put a clip probably before this screen was tweaking but now it's updating and once it's done updating i'm gonna leave because if it's still acting up after it's updated then something's wrong that's beyond my control so oh, girl i don't know okay take two i'm on my way to the apple store fifth avenue to see if they can fix this damn computer so stay tuned and i'm hot and i could barely speak in the camera so they basically told me that I'm going to have to pay $478 to fix my computer, but that only comes with three month warranty. So I'm trying to think now if I just want to buy a new computer and have like two year warranty or pay $478 and only have three months covered. So yeah, that's my life right now. Y'all can't see my mouth, but it's pretty straight. <laughs> Guys, I ended up buying a new computer. Crying in tears. I don't need anyone to ask me to go out to eat, to go out anywhere for the next two months. Please leave me inside. Um, this is an investment for my brand, for my business. That's how I'm looking at it. So I'm gonna just close my eyes, swipe my card, and bitch, I had to buy a whole new computer. A whole new computer. Like what? I was not expecting that. So before I open it up. Ooh, Jesus Christ. Before I open up this new computer, excuse my face, I'm still peeling. But um I did open an Apple card. I did let me put this down. I did apply and I did open an Apple card. I did it because um I don't know if I mentioned this in my credit card video. So if y'all didn't watch that, oh, I should have mentioned it then. But either way. I was like, the next card I want, I wanted to have international benefits where I get cash back and also I don't get charged like international fees. So I was there, I spoke to two people in the Apple store. Of course, you know, like they push it on you to sign up. But me personally, I know it fit my expectations for my next credit card. I get cash back benefits, um, whether I use like the card or I use Apple Pay. Um, it's a MasterCard, so it's accepted almost everywhere, which is another thing that I mentioned was a requirement. So if you guys didn't see that credit card video, make sure you guys check it out to see um, the credit card I have before, my Discover card, which I still have, and the Apple card I have now. Um, it basically fits the description of what I said, which was crazy, but whatever. So I bought it on my Apple card. I decided to just put the full amount on the card and then just pay it off. I probably paid it off in like a month or two or probably, I don't know, but I'm just trying to get it done. And you get 0% interest for any purchases like any apple purchases for six months i mean for 12 months so after you buy something like i bought my laptop today it was like 1500 dollars. so i have 12 months to pay off zero percent interest and then after the 12 months is when like the interest starts hitting but we ain't gonna get there okay we barely gonna make it to two months i'm just trying to pay this off and call it a day so I did use the educational promotion, even though I'm not a student no more, but I don't tell nobody. Um, I still have my student email, so I just showed the guy in the store, and he was just like, all right, cool. So I got um, the, let me get the earpods. <sighs> okay, so I got the MacBook Pro 13-inch. 
and then it came with the airpods for free these are just the basic ones if i wanted to upgrade to the um like new airpods it was 90 dollars more but i'm just like mm -hmm. this is just an extra pair of airpods i'm just gonna keep around just in case the pair i have now messes up or whatever the case is so that came together like that was the educational promotion and then i got a hundred dollars off the laptop so you know apple don't be having sales or anything so I feel like this is the best that it gets. Um, I think the promotion ends September 15th. So if you are a student, if you were once a student and you still got ID, email, or whatever that proves that you were a student, then you can use it. I would highly recommend to purchase Apple products around this time because besides back to school, they don't really have much specials. Um, I kind of still want to get an iPad, so I may get an iPad within the next week just so I could get that promotion. So we'll see. But I also um, purchased the U.S. What is this? The U, U, why am I? USB C to USB cord because the new laptop that I got doesn't, okay, focus, doesn't have like a USB port for my external hard drive. So let's go ahead and open her up. I hope my, oh yeah, oh shit. Oh my god and i did end up keeping my old laptop because even though like the brain is dead i don't think i told you guys but basically they ran tests on my old laptop and he was like the brain is basically dead which is why it was like flickering like that so he was like it's either i pay 478 and get it fixed and i have like a three month warranty or i buy a new laptop and you know get the apple care also with the educational promotion you get i think like an extra care, an extra year of apple care for free or something like that it was something with the apple care so on this laptop i have three years of apple care versus two so that was lit too so this is a box the macbook pro okay all right come on now oh i got the space gray i low-key wanted the silver but they didn't have the silver and the silver would take like a month to come so i was like let me go ahead and get the space gray so i actually need to order a case for her as soon as i finish recording this clip and also we gotta name her comment down below and let me know what i should name her but this is my new baby my first time touching her my her first time probably even being touched by anyone besides whoever produced it but it's so cute it's so sleek it's way lighter weight than my previous macbook so whew, cloth on the screen and all mm. oh she turned it on already hey 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 okay so i'm about to set oh I'm about to set this up. Um, it's just a headphone jack and then two USB C's to USB ports. So I'm gonna have to figure out what's the most efficient way to use those. If you have this laptop and you have like any of these converters that you find helpful for using SD cards, external hard drives, comment down below. Let me know. Um, send me links so that I could possibly like you know get the most out of these two little ports they give us. So. Yeah, that's it. I'm about to set up my computer and then I'll check in with you guys later on. Hey guys, so today is Thursday, September 3rd. I just wanted to show you guys what I got in the mail today. So the first thing that I got is a package from my Derma E family. So they sent over some products for eczema and scars. There's a scar gel. Focus. Okay, a scar gel. There is an eczema relief cream. Um, there is a Zerma E wrinkle. I don't know why my camera is acting like this. There's a Zerma E anti wrinkle treatment oil. So I'm honestly not going to use any of these because I don't have eczema. And y'all know how I am with my skincare products. I love Derma E's hair products that I've tried so far. But as far as skincare, I'm just going to stick to what I know. So if you guys are interested in these products, um, I'm looking to give these away. So all you would have to do is pay for shipping. So the first person who DMs me on Instagram at Kinesthetic underscore and, you know, says they're interested, um, I'll let you guys know how much shipping is and then I'll send it out to you. But yeah, that's the first thing I got. And then I got a retinol night treatment from my esthetician, Cynthia. This is her retinol all night treatment. I had the small one, but she came out with the big one. So I got the full size. I think this was like $85, I want to say. But this retinol is bomb. So I'll be using that. And then I got my Twisted Saints 
swimsuit. So if you guys watched my previous vlog, you guys saw that. Your girl woke up early to get this one. Well, not early, but I had took a nap and then I woke up at three to make sure I secured my Wildcat swimsuit from Twisted Stain. So you guys will see me wear this on an upcoming trip. So I don't want to try it on yet, but I'm excited to wear her. But this is everything I got in the mail today. I'm waiting on my hat from Tear NYC and I think that's it for now. Oh no, I have some packages coming from asos um and amazon so let me tell y'all my plans for this weekend so if you follow me on instagram you saw that yesterday was fatima's birthday let me get in the sun so y'all can see me <laughs> yesterday was my friend fatima's birthday in case you guys don't know fatima is the founder ceo of musu beauty which is the body butter lip scrub lip balm brand that i promote here on my channel it is black owned muslim owned and woman owned so she owns that and she's having like a little picnic for her birthday on saturday so i'm gonna go to that and then sunday is our content corner picnic so super excited for that you guys will see both of those events in today's vlog y'all i don't know what's happening over here but it needs to get it together for this weekend so yeah i am what am i doing i need to go out today to get some last minute things for the content corner picnic and then i need to go downtown to return my dress in nordstrom and i also need to do that exchange in sephora that i probably mentioned early in this vlog but yeah i'm about to i'm waiting for my phone to charge because when i was getting ready to leave my phone was on 10 percent, of course so now it's on 76 percent. i'm gonna wait for it to get to 100 and then i'm gonna go to the fabric store and run downtown and then come back home so yeah i also worked out this morning i feel so good i did not work out yesterday because y'all know i had a stressful day yesterday i had to drop a bag yesterday and i just had to mentally reflect on that um so i'm back on my workout game five times a week or more and yeah so i'm gonna do my zoom and then i'll check in with you guys later hi guys so today is saturday september 5th and i just woke up from an amazing nap i'm about to get ready now to go to fatima's birthday picnic um but you girl got some mail as you guys can see i probably recognize this print the dress that i showed you guys in my last vlog the extra small came today so i want to show it to you guys so don't mind the mess in my room <laughs> but this is the extra small if it's way better like it's giving the girls a look i need to button the top but it's giving the girls a look okay so i'm super excited that i got this dress and that it was on sale and that it fits so cute also last time i vlogged you guys saw i had like a new breakout so it's healing now but guys the best news i got this week was that my esthetician is opening back on october 2nd like y'all i have not seen cynthia since march 3rd i've been home taking care of my skin struggling achieving going backwards going forwards it's just been a lot so october 2nd i need that first appointment back honey okay so when she opens her calendar i will be on it because y'all know i don't play so i'm about to get ready for fatima's picnic now let me show you guys how many things i ordered like i ordered outfit um i ordered outfit options i ordered all of this from asos amazon and I think I'm going to end up wearing something for my classes. So I'm about to try on like full outfits now to see what type of tea I'm given. And then I'll shower real quick, do my makeup. And do my makeup real quick so that my makeup can comp complement whatever outfit I decide to put on. And yeah, so I'm going to put the AC on because I'm hot. So I'll check in with you guys right before I leave so y'all can see my outfit and all of that. So yeah. <laughs> No, we got it. <laughs> All right. 
this day like maybe for a month now and I was freaking out and I was like a little afraid of the rain coming I just thought all the most negative things that you could think about today but like when I walked in here I just thought it was so beautiful you guys like y'all went hard for me like you guys look beautiful and that's just a testament to the type of friends you guys are anything that I do you guys support me anything that I think of you guys remind me that no dream is too big and I appreciate each and every last one of you. All of you have a special place in my heart and our friendship just means the world to me. So thank you guys for coming. I pray that God gives us another year of friendship, that God gives us wealth, happiness, success. We are black women and men and we are we just bomb, bomb as fuck. Okay. I love y'all, thank you so much for coming. We love you. Yeah. Yeah. Good morning. Today is Sunday, September 6th, the day of the content corner event. Sorry for the bad lighting. I am currently cutting up our raffle tickets that I made. I made these in Canva and we're doing a raffle for our gift bags. Um, so we're giving a gift bag to the first person who RZP for the event. So I have to look to see who that is. And then we're going to do four raffle ticket winners. Yeah, our bags are so lit. I'm going to put um clips here what Camille Rose Black but thank you guys so so much for sponsoring content corners events love you guys oh thank you so much trailer another sponsor of our content corner goodie bags period but um we wanted to make sure that our gift bags were 100 percent black owned products so we hit up some of our favorite brands and they gave us some goodies so camille rose naturals blessed as always y'all know i love camille rose naturals like when i tell y'all i rock with camille rose naturals that was the first brand to really like believe in me when i um started my influencer journey so i'll always always remember that and i'll always always respect and love them for that and they just always hold it down. So they sent over a good amount of stuff. And then Trey Lux, which is another brand that believes in me so much, sent over some goodies as well. So we have that. Musu Beauty. Y'all know I love Musu Beauty. Their body butters, their lip scrubs, and their lip balms. Fire. So we got some goodies from them. And we also are getting some goodies from Capria NY, which is um, the Stush Life. Stush, if y'all don't follow her, make sure y'all follow her here on YouTube too. Um... She has like a beauty brand. She sells like lashes, mirrors, and um, some other goodies. So you guys can check them out too if you guys are interested in checking out some black owned brands. Um, but I'm just cutting up these tickets now, you guys. I woke up later than expected. I still haven't brushed my teeth, still haven't washed my face, still haven't washed my ass. I just want to finish everything that I have to do for the picnic first. So once I get ready, like I know I could just leave the house. It's currently 11:25. Wanted to get there at one. So that I can like post a location and we can start setting up. Um, so I feel like I could still make it there by one. I just have to finish cutting these up. I in the backdrop. I already like packed my little buggy cart. Um, and I think that's about it. And then I just have to get ready. As far as outfits, I don't know what I'm wearing. But it's in a good way because I have a multiple outfit options so i'm gonna show you guys my options and then i'm gonna pick something put it on 
and call it a day. Um, I am so exhausted from yesterday. I got home actually early. Like, Carisha and I left at like 8 o'clock from Fatima's picnic. But I was up until like 2 a.m. for some reason. And I didn't even realize it was 2 a.m. And I sent Carisha something on Instagram. And she was like, girl, why are you so awake? And I'm like, wow, I didn't even peep that it was freaking 2 o'clock in the morning. So, I ended up going to bed at 2. I woke up at like 9. Um, and... I knew I had stuff to do, so I'm just rushing to do everything now. But you guys, Hatima's picnic was so cute. Like, we had so much fun. The only thing is that if you're in New York City and you out after the sun sets and it gets dark and you're in a public park, honey, the ratatouilles of the world will come out and, and rain on your parade, okay? So once we saw a little correlation, it was time to go, so... Same order for today. As soon as the sun sets, the event is over because that's when the bugs come out. That's when the rodents come out. And we don't have time for that. Also, when the sun sets, it's like if there's no street lights or there's no source of light, then it, you can't see anything. So we said that the event will be over at 7 p.m. today. So from 2 to 7, um, I'm super excited. I'm super excited. I'm charging my other battery for my camera because I forgot to do that yesterday. And I left the house with one battery that was half dead. But I was able to take the pictures I wanted to take yesterday. So I wasn't too bothered. But I told myself, I'm like, girl, your battery should always be charged. So, um, yeah, I'm about to finish cutting these up. I feel like I had something else to tell y'all. Um, aw, Courtney just wrote me and said, good luck. You guys, Courtney is so amazing. Her Instagram is Courtney Casanova. I met her at BeautyCon last year, actually. And she's so supportive. Like, I really, really love her. If you're watching this, Courtney, I love you, girl. Um, but she's super, super supportive. She just wrote me. Good luck. I already know it's going to be fire. Yes, this is going to be a very big thing. Um, but, yeah, tomorrow's Labor Day. And not that I forgot, but since I've been working from home and since work has been kind of slow, um, I'll be forgetting, like, what days I actually have off. So I have off from work tomorrow for Labor Day. And you guys, I don't want to do nothing. Like when I say I don't want to do nothing, like I just want to clean my room because my room is a mess. And I know I'm not going to have the energy to clean it today. I want to do laundry tomorrow. I'm going to work out tomorrow. And then for the rest of the day, I really just want to chill out. I'll probably um, I get a head start on content, probably record some things, probably edit some things. But as far as like going out, gallivanting, being in somebody's backyard, drinking Ray and Nephew, eat, like I don't, like I really just want to be inside tomorrow. So I'm low-key happy that, you know, Corona is here to give us an excuse to stay inside because, girl, I have zero energy to do anything tomorrow. I went outside yesterday. I'm going outside today. I usually go out one day a weekend. So this is a lot for your girl, okay? So tomorrow I'll be indoors. I'll be working and, um that's that on that so let me finish doing what i have to do and then i'll check in with you guys when i'm getting dressed Just a jump. Okay. I'm playing no games. Come get this. Come get this <laughs> Yeah. 
Hi guys, so I'm about to repop my aloe plant and my majesty plant for Jesta. I still haven't named my aloe plant. So, um, if you guys have any name suggestions, comment down below and let me know. But I'm going to repot the aloe in this little planter that I got from TJ Maxx. This one was $5.99. So, real cute. And then I also got the same pattern, but a bigger one for my Majesty plant. This one was $7.99. So, these are going to look real cute next to each other. So... I have those. I got this aloe plant from um, Home Depot. It was... I don't have the receipt, but I think it was like three, four dollars. And then I got this majesty plant from Trader Joe's. So I'm gonna show you guys how I repot my aloe and my majesty plant. My associate plant consultant, Kim, is gonna help with repotting so she's gonna provide instructions i'm gonna do it and we're gonna get this done okay okay so i have a glove on to protect my hand and i also put like an empty um trash bag on the floor just to make sure like you know i could clean up easily so this is the soil that i got for the aloe and the uh, majesty plant this is the miracle grow cactus palm and citrus potting mix so i'll put the price of this on the screen how much i paid for it but this is what i'm going to be using just so you guys know Okay, so do the same thing. First of all, it's mad water in here. Oh, yes, yes, so that's oh, the no. drainage. The, um... The roots? Yeah. Yeah, so it needed to be repotted then. Okay. So this is Majesta, and then my aloe plants all repotted, okay? Okay, so I just finished repotting my aloe and my majesty plant. So right now I have them here, but I do want to get like a little cart. I need to clean up, guys. But I, I want to get a little cart to put them here because these are basically my plants that don't need direct light in. So I got the aloe plant from Home Depot um, when I went that day. It was like 3 or $4. My majesty plant, which you guys have seen before, Trader Joe's. And then I got a Lucky Bamboo plant. This was $12, I believe, from Home Depot. So I have these three here. And then I have my two plants that need direct lighting over here. So I have my spearmint plant. This is the one I got from Trader Joe's. I had to get out and repotted it. But you guys, look at how much it's sprouting. It's so excited because I really thought that I was killing her. And then this is, I think this is a peppermint plant, but it's growing so much it's getting so much taller so i'm about to take some progress pictures right now so i can have them for my reference and yeah 
hey guys so i've been sleeping slash busy all day running around doing things but yesterday was a content corner event and you guys the love that was received from you guys to Karisha and I was so amazing. The people who came out, the people who wished us luck, the sponsors for the goodie bags, um, and everything else. So we were really, really excited. We're so grateful. This was our first event. Many, many more to come. Um, and the fact that so many people were asking at our first event, like, what's the next event? When is the next event? Just showed how much that people really... Love the event, love the vibes, love the energy, and we're excited because Content Corner is growing and glowing, period. If you don't follow us on Instagram, follow us at Content Corner. We're basically, we started our brand to create a space for creators, whether you're an influencer, a photographer, a brand owner, anything where you have to create content. We want people to feel more confident. We want people to... um meet each other we want people to just be more lax in this environment with content creation now i feel like people have made it into like a competition or uh i have all the secret the secret formula and i'm not sharing it with anyone but we want to basically that's that's negative connotation to content creation we want it to be fun we want people to get to know each other the fact that I had friends, co-workers, friends from high school, friends from college, co-workers, um, friends from social media, like so many different people came out and I really, really love the fact that people started speaking and met each other before I even came over to introduce them. So that really, really, like I love networking. Like I love meeting new people. I love like, you know, just building my network, getting to know people. I am gonna do an influencer chat soon on like how to network because a lot of people always compliment me on my networking skills and I'm like, it's not that hard, but also with my professional career, I have, I had to have learned how to network, you know? Let me turn this way for the light. But that influencer chat is coming soon. More content corner events coming soon. Make sure you guys follow us on Instagram and you guys are looking out. We have a lot of different types of events coming. So I hope that you guys are ready for those. But I just wanted to thank everybody so much. And I wanted to also inform you guys about our brand in case you guys don't know about it. Whether you guys are new to my channel. If you are, to make sure you subscribe too because we're doing big things over here. Or if you are... Um, a loyal subby and you probably don't follow me on instagram or you don't have instagram and you guys don't know about it um but we are also working we're working on a lot of things okay so just wait it's coming and that's that on that period but i think this is it for this week's vlog um i didn't really do much i was really like outside trying to enjoy myself i also didn't really vlog too much at the picnic because i was like around taking pictures speaking to people um getting to know people so sorry if the vlog clips weren't enough for you but hopefully you learned through that event and you saw through that event that it was a success and everyone was having fun and it was a great vibe but that's all i have for today's vlog i feel like i got a 10 girl okay I'm also using my um, glow pad, so I'm peeling. I'm about to start peeling probably tomorrow because I just started back last night. But that's it for this week's vlog. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Um, before you guys head out from my channel, make sure you guys check out my previous vlogs. I'm doing weekly vlogs now so you guys can see behind the scenes of my crazy life, um, my productive life, my positive life. And I just want to share my energy with you guys on a weekly basis so you guys don't see me like, you know, just sitting down in front of a camera like, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And you guys can actually see like what goes on in my life. So I hope you guys are enjoying these vlogs. Make sure you guys subscribe, give this video a big thumbs up, drop a comment down below. And until my next video, which will be on Friday, I'll see you guys later. Love you.